What's up everybody? It's your girl Shay Skyler and I'm here with a new video. I want to show you guys how I achieve these beautiful luscious curls and that left my hair super soft using a naturally as I am hair product. So it's just going to be a review and a tutorial on how I achieve these curls. So make sure you stay tuned and subscribe. products work with my specific hair texture. Um, the products that I'm using are the As I Am, Beautiful Coral and um, Naturally. Um, I'm going to be using Glow Waggy. This was the Coconut Co-Wash Cleansing Conditioner. And uh, this is how it looks. Sorry, my bottle's like messy, but I just finished. And it's made with tangerine oil, castor oil, salt, palmetto, and uh, by Testerol. Alright, and it smells really good. And I actually think that I put this on my Facebook just to get like some insight from my natural friends. Because I have a lot of friends who are natural and I just want to get um, their understanding of how the product looks with their hair. And we all have different hair textures, so I know it probably wouldn't be the same. And I have some friends who said that the product was awesome, and I have some friends who said product with that. So I wanted to try it out for myself. Um, what I did with the cold wash was I just washed my hair and then I rinsed and I also detangled while the product was in my hair and then I detangled after. So it did leave my hair very soft. Um, my curls are back even though I do see I have to be in the hair right here the front. So we're not going to discuss that because we have to refer back to fix of the new curl pattern. But this is basically a um, my curls and how they look when my hair is washed and I'm combing them out but that's how they look now. Someone did tell me they want me they wanted me to do a length check and I would prefer to do that when my hair is dry and flat iron. But I'm just going to stretch my hair here and because my hair is like different lengths all over. Like it's weird. And when I flat iron it Today I'll be using the leave-in conditioner and I'll put that in now and it's made with the same thing, uh, the sugar thing, and the coconut. And it smells really good and it's by as I am as well. And then I'm going to be using the twist defining cream, uh, which is from Shiny Food Twist and Twist Out. And this is how it looks. Okay? And I'm going to be using my Curl Lot. Roll and twist and that did to get that like coily kind of curl that I saw and I'll attach the person to make the So the first thing that I'm going to be doing is taking some of my conditioner and putting some in my hand. It's going to be about quarter size and I'm just going to massage that and rub that into my hair. Make sure that I distribute that from the top of my hair to the ends to make sure that uh, it's evenly distributed all over my hair because it really helps to hold your style and I definitely want to see how this product works so me distributing the product everywhere is a must. Next, I'm going to be taking my wide tooth comb and parting my hair, making sure that I part and get the right amount of hair that I need in order to achieve the curl that I want to fix the curling rod. After I do that, I'm going to make sure that I detangle any tangles that I might have in my hair. Then I'm going to make sure that um, that's enough that I'm looking for. 
I'm going to take the As I Am Twist Cream and it smells really good and I'm just going to apply that all over the part that I mean because this product is very important when I am getting ready to set to ride. So this is the way that I do the twist and roll. I'm just going to distribute some more cream into my hair. Then I'm just going to twist my hair starting from the root and I'm just going to twist it down, twist, and you have to make sure that you detangle before you do this and then I'm going to pull it up because it's easier for me to roll. Once I do that, I'm just going to take my flexi rod, flexi rod, sorry guys, I'm just going to take my curly rod and I'm going to just roll that around and I'm going to do it away and then I'm just going to roll it all the way down while it's still twisted and just go all the way making sure that it's nice snug and tight i'm just going to clamp that so now once that's complete you're going to have your set of perm rods in your hair and you're just going to wrap it with a satin bonnet after that the next morning you're going to take those perm rods out Okay, and I actually didn't let my hair dry all the way, which super sucked because I believe that it would have come out a little bit nicer, but it's okay because it's the first time for everything and I had to work in the morning, so I didn't want to sit under a dryer, so I actually just took my dryer, you know, and I didn't want to wait. So once all the perm rods are out, this is how my curls look before I decided to take my wide tooth comb that has like a little picking mechanism thing going on in the back and just, you know, gave my hair some body. Um, my hair was really thick and really soft. The products left my hair really soft and I really liked them initially, but we'll see once I use them again, but they were great products. <laughs> Thanks for watching, guys. Subscribe.